Hey guys, I'm the Orange Foot Soldier, and welcome back to another Rise of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle review. So today, we are going to be reviewing in April, the Street Smart Best Friend, and Splinter, the Chill Master. So, here we have April, um, in her new Rise of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles design. She's African American, and yeah, she's... She's pretty cool. I like her in the show, so, but, yeah. And then Splinter, he's, he is totally redesigned, um, with his short, stubby body and being pretty chunky and fat. But let's talk about design now. So you can see this card back here. So kind of compared to that, because that's the one from this TV show. So first off, you can see that she she's not wearing her glasses when she's back there. And for the most part of the TV show, she always wears them, and she has this cool hair design. Here's her face. Cool design. And her boots. Her back. Nothing special. Just kind of hands the ear and whatnot. Please stand for me, April. Please, please. Thank you. <clears throat> and here's Splinter. Um, he has this cool like beard. That's what he kind of looks like in the cartoon. It's pretty ugly in the cartoon. Looks a lot more. I don't want to say cute, but more better like <laughs> in <clears throat> the action figure form. Um, it'd be nice if this was painted right here, but even if his hair was a little. Painted too, but you know, gotta get what you can get for like eight bucks. And he has hard torso up here and more softer robe feet. And he has this cool, like, little tail here. So let's get go ahead and get into articulation. So both of these are pretty different. So, first off, April can look side to side. 360 and she can look up that much which that's actually pretty decent I guess she look down that much and she's just on a ball joint shoulders can go up that high it's pretty like it's just straight angle and you got shoulder rotation you have elbow bend which is pretty much 90 degrees and you have elbow Swivel and no wrist swivel because look how tiny the wrist are. And forearm and the leg goes out that much, goes or forward that much, and then back that much. And it can go out straight out, not straight out, but like out that much, which is pretty good. Then you have thigh swivel and then you have knee bend. This isn't like the greatest. And you have a swivel. And then that's it. And no ankle articulation. Okay. So that's pretty much going to do it with April O'Neill. The street smart best friend. And as you can see, she has a very, very hard time standing. Mm, probably worse. Um, almost as bad as the foot soldier so i'm just gonna lean her up there now splinter is very basic so you can look left right but as you can see the torso is moving so i want to get into that he has this torso articulation and his arm could go up like that much it's kind of weird it's just kind of up and down pretty much back but it's not that much articulation and nothing right there. And pretty much the same thing with this one, just a different pose. And legs, really barely any articulation. And I always kind of get back to this. So, yeah, that's pretty much it for the articulation side of things. So, let's why not to get into accessor accessories. Starting off with April. Sorry if I moved the camera there. See if I can get her to stand. <coughs> so, her first accessory is this 
cool little dog cat thing. I forget the name of it, but it's pretty cool and it looks pretty accurate to the show. It has this blue top. It's cool, nice eyes, little whiskers, and some teeth. The red hair is actually pretty nice. The blue tail. And then you can see there's kind of a design supposed to be like painted on, um, like right here, right here. And sits pretty well. And April Weapon is this <clears throat> cool little green baseball bat. Even though it doesn't really look much like a baseball bat. And it looks pretty good. And she could hold it decently. And I'll be back. Guys. My cat wants to get on my eyes. So like I was saying, I'm sorry for that cut. Because, yeah. so like I was saying, she could hold it pretty decently, but she has very squishy hands. And she could hold it, she could hold it okay. Just kind of hold it down here at the bottom. Yeah, I was messing with her last night. Let's see if she can hold it. And she kind of can. Just because it just doesn't stay in her hand because it's so gummy but I don't pose her with it and yeah she can hold it okay upright pretty decently <clears throat> and that's for that bat then she has another bat which is this cool little mystic bat I don't think I've ever seen her in the show at least in season one because that's the only one I watch use a bat but this one's nice and cool and it's like all mystical and a cool translucent green. It has the flames, kind of like the one here. And it's pretty much like the same, the same thing where she could barely even hold it. I don't even know if she could hold this one. Yeah, barely even holding on. Kind of see from that angle. But she could somewhat hold it and not stay in there. That's probably, yeah. <clears throat> I'm not going to even try with April. And more. And now Splinter comes with uh, this little same as a ninja. Two of these throwing stars. And a nice little close up of them. Stop focusing on Splinter, please. And I don't even know if you can hold them. I don't really. Yes. Yeah, you can somewhat hold them. Something like that. And just knock it out of his hand. And then he also has this cool um little walking stick little thing. It has some nice printing details. It's just all sculpted one color. And you can see this little slit right there. And you pull on this and it's a sheath. For this cool blade that you can hold. I don't display him like this. But he can hold it pretty okay, but just gonna it barely holds on to there, but I don't display him like that. Sorry, I'm a little shaky. And just I just put it in his hand to where it you know, touches the ground so it acts like a walking stick. Here, make a stand. So, guys, that's gonna have to do it for this video. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. So, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'm the what the orange foot soldier. Peace out.